guys, welcome to Flight Test. With the popularity of our new speed build kits, we thought it would be good to give you some fast tips. And we got three of them here for your control surfaces. Uh, first, I'm gonna talk about sanding a hinge, then making control horns, and repairing a hinge that's pulled away from the paper. First off, let's talk about cutting the chamfer for your hinge. Uh, it can be dangerous for kids if they're using blades. So one of the things we wanted to do is recommend using sandpaper. However, sandpaper doesn't work the greatest by itself. Here's a neat little trick. Get a small wood block, squirt some hot glue on it, attach your sandpaper, trim away the excess, and now you got a nice little sanding block that's safe for the kids and easy to use. It's good to have nice control horns, but if you don't, maybe you have a zip tie. This is super simple. Just cut it to length, Use a small drill bit or the point of an X-Acto blade. You can, you can twist it around to make the hole. Use a little hot glue and voila, a professional looking control horn that costs next to nothing to make. The next thing we're gonna talk about is the paper pulling away from the hinge. It's hard to spot and it can definitely cause an accident. The first thing you wanna do is disconnect your control arm. Then you wanna cut a little squeegee. We're gonna use this with the hot glue. Put a little hot glue on it, skim it across, real thin, real thin coat let it dry, let it cool. Make sure it's not tacky before you test the hinge. Okay, now test your hinge and it should be as good as new, probably even better. All right, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. See you next time.